I fuck with shawty cause she bought a business, ayy She independent and she on a mission, ayy Been through some shit but now it's better living, ayy What's up, Flavor Squad? It's your girl, Fashion. We sure here to give you all the flavor. If you are new here, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe and make sure you comment down below. Hashtag Flavor Squad. If you are not new here, I thank you so much for coming back to my channel. And today, y'all, we're going to do a no so DIY. And we're doing a no so DIY because my machine is down. It's sick, girl. We got to get her fixed. So we're going to do a no so DIY. And we're going to make this super cute top right here and i'm gonna show you guys the inspiration right here so that you can know like what we're going for and you know where this came from so yeah if you're interested in seeing how i made this top and how you can also make this top for little to no money just keep on watching okay y'all so this scarf was thrifted from the goodwill store and i actually showed this scarf on my story one day so if you missed it make sure you follow me the first step i'm going to do is to just make sure i fold it as straight as possible it doesn't have to be perfect because this literally is like going to be a flowy top so it doesn't have to be perfect everything doesn't have to be perfect but i'm going to just fold it and then i'm going to measure out how much i need to cut So the first measurement you'll need to take is your boob width. My boob width was seven inches. So you're going to double that to 14. So you want each side of the top to be 14 inches each so that you can have enough coverage. You actually can add a little more than your measurement doubled if you want. The more coverage, the better, and it only flows more. So if you wanna add more, go right ahead. Then I'm just going to cut out 14 inches across and just cut that all the way down. the next measurement you want to take is your waist measurement and with this measurement you can add as much as you like i think i added maybe let's see i added seven more inches than my actual waist length so i did 30 plus 7 you can add more if you want your string to hang longer after finding that measurement i just went to the scrap fabric that I had left and measured out 37 inches since that's the length that I wanted my waist tie to be. If you want it longer, you can make it longer. I actually wish I made mine longer, but I didn't. And I think I just made it about um, four inches wide. You can also make it as wide as you like. That doesn't really matter because it's gonna bunch up anyway. But I think I made it four inches wide and 37 inches long. Okay, y'all, so this is the top that we just made. Super quick, easy, and simple. It is so cute. I'm definitely in love with how it came out. And you can adjust it, move it, however you would like, whatever makes you comfortable. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. It's definitely a risky top, girl. You're going to have to cover the boobs, okay? But I think it's super cute. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Let me know if y'all like this video. If you want more like this, make sure you comment that down below. And if you're new here, make sure you subscribe. Don't leave here without subscribing. Turn on your post notification bell, okay? But that's all I have for you guys. Some of your curls popping. Your girl never stops like a squad. I'm out of here.
Yeah. Should've known you was fucking with a boss.